Okay, let's get another energy for the day. Right, I've done one energy. What, what's the other energy going on? Whoops, what have I seen today? The lamb and the hyenas. And it's none of them. Right, okay. So, what this is talking about, right, this magical uni unicorn, what it's talking about is, um, obviously, your third eye, right? And it's obviously a lot, this is a lot to do with spirituality. This is you questioning, or ab absolutely know that you're in the process, or you questioning the process. Like, is it real? Does it, you know, um, and, and what's happening, what the universe is saying, really, is you just weave your webs. You just keep in your lane. You just weave your own webs. And, and see to your own self, right, oblivious of everybody else, just get focused and do your stuff. Because um, the, the spider card says that the universe already trusts that you will make the right choices. This journey will make you be able to do all the right choices. That's what it's saying to you. Um... What else? How do you get to the... Right. How do you get to the... This is just like the oyster. The one. Or how do I... Oh, the only way I can get to the emperor. Is this the only way I can get to the empress? Um. Whoa, that's... That's a hard one. See, the, a, an empress, all the time, she has new opportunities coming in she is abundant within herself she embodies all the four queens um she just creates that's what an empress does so um it doesn't mean to say that you can't have anything to do with an empress than not if, if you're in Empress energy, it's not over, it's, it, it's not over people, it's not that, it's nothing to do with that, that's ego stuff, do you know what I mean, it, it, it's nothing to do with it, um, but I, if somebody you know and love is, is this, right, this is why you're asking for this journey, about this journey and um an empress will will take somebody um she will love somebody who um basically is on her wavelength you you can't you've got to have you know things in common um but no she's not higher than you she's not she's not better than you She's better than four queens. <laughs> she is, right? If you're an empress, right? You're better than four queens. You, you know, this this type of person is, is worth doing the work. That's what I'm being trying to spit out, right? It's worth the work. And, and once you start doing the work, it, 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 it's fine. I don't even know. Right. You start doing the work, right? And then you see exciting things happen. So you start doing that. You start just concentrating on your own business, right? Just, <laughs> just concentrate on your own stuff. Be charming. Be, be an empress. Um, <laughs> an empress will adore any of the night. Look, that's what I'm saying. They don't have to be kings, queens or anything. It's just the energy that you're embodying. Right? She likes in her masculines that, that, um, that attitude of the, 
you're not phased about nothing, right? That you have more motivation. She wants you to be charming. She wants to share her joy with you. She likes people on a mission because that's what she is. Always on a mission until she collapses in day four. So, your, my, your answer to your question, which I think is a male question from, from masculines, because masculines are now the ones who are asking all these questions because they, they, they're seeing the, the feminine aspects even in their selves rise up. Do you know what I mean? They know that something's happening inside and most are just shoving them down and taking no notice, but most are starting to feel it that there's something going on here. And this is why the, these masculines, it could be just in yourself or this masculine, could be thinking, you know, well, I, I'd, I'd have to be like that, wouldn't I, if I wanted to be with an empress of whatever, right? If, you know, she runs whatever company, I would have to be up to, no, no, it, no, that's, it's got nothing, what's coming, right? It's got nothing to do with material things, right? It's nothing to do with egos, right? The world is changing and it's going to be, it's going to be more balanced. You can never get rid of all, all of this, you know, haters and, you know what I mean, hold your ground. This comes out all of the time for me, right? Whenever I get disheartened, that one comes out, hold your ground. Just hold your ground. Don't ever think that you, you're less than anyone. And don't worry about these neither. Just keep determined of what you want to do. Well, there was an important thing there I was telling you. Um, don't. Nobody is better than anybody else. And this, and this is what the world is turning into. It's going to be more about um, your character, your your strength of character um, and about your personality. It's going to be more about that. That's what I'm saying. So everybody has to do this journey anyway. So why not? If it's, if it's for an actual person that you think is the Empress, then isn't it worth it? Isn't it worth putting in the work which is only going to absolutely blow your mind, right? To, to get what you want. That's that answer. I hope it helped. <laughs> Please give a like.